all right guys welcome back to this channel in today's video let's look at how we can resolve this particular error whenever it pops up when you're carrying out your registration with cc you see the an error like this uh oops 404 not found sorry an error has occurred requested page not found right so this mostly happens when you are currently registered the you've um, reserved the business right and after the reservation has been done you've got an approval code and that approval code you want to uh, carry out the registration with the approval code and you've gone to your start a new registration on the portal which i'll be showing you right now and you put in the approval code so that you can start the registration and it ends up bringing up that error now the first thing is that this error always co mostly comes up in situations whereby um, you are using a mobile phone right i've always observed that it happens most times when you use mobile phone but still it doesn't still mean that it doesn't happen when you use your laptop your pc or other devices right it can still happen even when you are using your normal uh, pc and all when it happens this is how you can resolve this particular error right so let's go into the video as i show you how to navigate through this so let me log into my um, account right now very quickly and so one thing you should take note is that when resolving this error you must focus on the registration itself what i mean by that is this you must be able to copy the um the correct approval code because i know that most people when they copy the approval code they are not copying the correct appro approval code that CSC actually sent to them right so they end up not pasting the correct approval code that way you get an error so most time when the error always comes up when you um, go to the approval you copy the approval code after copying the approval code you go back to the um um, registration you come to new registration new common registration you paste the approval code right and you search for the name of the business and once you search for the name of the business it shows up an error right it shows up an error or maybe the approval code you copy is not correct and you keep searching and it's not correct or the registration has been for that particular business the registration i copied has already been completed and, uh, already so let's copy under approval code so that will quickly show you what I, I'm trying to say. Okay, so let's use this approval code quickly. Copy, and then come to the um, new registration, and then paste the new registration. You can see that this was not properly pasted, so it can bring an error. So you delete every um, unnecessary details that comes from there. So on PC, when you try it on PC like this, you can always click on start registration, and it will go through, and you'll be able to fill in details of the client, and then go ahead with the registration right but meanwhile look up this now this is very important and uh, it's very important for me to uh show you this now right when carrying out uh posting uh when carrying out registration on cc the first thing you must make sure you understand is that um you must be able to use a laptop or a pc i would not encourage you if you want to really do this as a business or uh, it's good if you're starting off right if this is the first time you're doing you can see the phone and all and these errors we keep com we keep uh, uh, coming up, right? Whenever you have registrations like this, you keep having this kind of error. So to avoid this kind of error, don't use your piece, your your don't use your phone. So let me show you what I'm trying to say. Look up now. So you see that on your screen on the dashboard right now. When I click on reserved registration, reserved, right? You see that on this reserved registration, you can see three things, three options for a new registration. I'm seeing three options. The first option is the start registration the second one is the approval no the third one is the download receipt but if you are using a mobile phone if you are using a mobile phone format right you will not be seeing all those three options the options you'll be seeing you can see the, now this is the mobile phone option you can see my screen right now you can see that the third option is not coming up if i'm recording my screen on, on mobile option you see that the second option is the third option is not coming up i'm only seeing the approval right the approval i'm only seeing the date it was approved i'm not even seeing the possibility of downloading the approval notes do you see that so that's one of the issues most people face so by the time they you can sometimes in on the mobile phone you show the approval um uh, approval detail so if you show the approval detail good if you show the approval detail it means that you can copy the approval code right and then go ahead with the registration with the approval code but that approval code now when you paste it you bring up that error so to avoid that particular error now the best best thing is to either put your phone on a uh, what is it called now uh, desktop mode when you bring it on desktop mode then voila it will show up 
the start registration uh, option button. So once you click on the start registration button, you will be able to carry out the registration without that error 404 popping up. It will never come up. So that's the option. So if you don't have a laptop and you use a mobile phone, the best option is to use your when you are doing any job with corporate affairs commission, always make sure you use the desktop mode. That way you'll be able to see all the options and you'll be able to avoid all these errors. I hope this video has been very helpful to you. So if you would like to enroll uh, in a CSC class, you want someone that can teach you or you want a course that can teach you how to go about everything about CSC, um, registration of business, team number registration and every other thing, I'll be dropping a link below. You can reach out to me and then we'll be able to give you access to our course and also uh, access to our accredited account as well, right? So I'll see you in other videos. My name is Akimbola Ezekiel. Thank you.